So the first kind of models are called classical models. And remember when we say classical models, it means we are talking about those cities, those urban places which began with the advent of urbanization during industrial revolution. So we observe E.M. Burgess, this scholar, first time from Chicago School of Sociology in 1925, gave the first urban morphology theory that is internal structure of a city where his model is called classical model of city structure and city growth. Now, what does this model talk about? Let's understand. So he says that concentric zonation or zonal model of the city is where urban growth happens. It means a city has a concentration at particular point and alongside there are different zones which can be plotted through concentric circle model. And between these circle, these areas have different land uses. Right? This is the basic idea of his work 